it is it hard? Is it hard to is it hard to pull that with scurvies? <laughs> it's shingle. Oh. <laughs> Your driveway? Cool. Yeah, but not all day. Sometimes we'll do it all day long. Papa picked up a ATV trailer cool. from Cabela's or Mom, maybe Mama. I don't know who paid for it. Sugar. What does it have for capacity? 1500. Oh, 1500, but the. the Junkie Polaris only has a thousand, right? A thousand. Okay. And well, how much was it? Three ninety six. For four hundred bucks, what a rip! So I think it's got a dump. Does it dump? Dump. Want to hook it up? Yeah. I don't know if it'll hook up to a crappy Polaris, but I guess we'll find out. Oh, I guess it does. Dump it. You're supposed to be able to just touch it with your foot, and it helps. Just, just touch it. You had to touch it with your hand too. It looked like. Well, if you have weight in there, I'm sure it'll dump itself. Maybe. Is there some type of protecting, protecting on here that you just smack it down oh, like that? Oh, no, against concrete. <laughs> yeah, I think we put something fluffy under there, Bob. So then this, does this, when this, does that hinge out so that you can actually dump stuff out of it no, then or I what? No, I think what it does is it's... Oh, it just lifts out of there? Oh, okay. So now you, the dump feature actually does work then. And everything else is kind of squeezed, squeezed together so it stays in here. This is just a squeeze fit. And with the Cadabos name... Cadabos? Cadabos? It's a C lifetime warranty. Cadabos. Is it bad? I think it's actually Bass Pro Shop yeah. now, isn't it? Yeah, well, it's owned by Bass Pro. So it has a lifetime warranty apparently. I don't know what that means. We'll just have to light it on fire and see if they'll replace it. Cool. Mm -hmm. Well, they make, they make more heavy duty, more expensive ones, but we thought, you know, let's try to sell it for the price it can't be beat. Really? Well, All right. Start, what started out is that this actually is one piece and that's one piece, and then when you build it upside down, and you put it together and there's like four bolts that hold together. And then the axle actually is two piece, but there's a brace in the middle. I don't know if you see from underneath. How long did it take? I don't know, I worked on it slowly. I'd say it took maybe an hour. I don't know what I'm looking for, but on this. There's a brace underneath, it's an axle, and it's a two piece axle, and then you bolt this brace together, and then the, the axle actually holds everything together too. Cool. Well, we'll be cutting a smaller box. You know, the box isn't this big. Of course, the box is probably only like this big. Yep. But well, I don't know. We'll be cutting trees and different stuff today, so maybe we'll throw stuff in it and see how well it works, and see if we can dump it out. But yeah, we haven't you haven't used it for anything yet, have you? No. So, yeah, we'll get some use out of it and let you know if it sucks or if it's good. So, all right. All right, just, just got to cut some trails, cut some wood up, a couple logs, not too much, but enough to load the tra uh, trailer up here and give it, give it a test. Uh, see how, how much it holds, how much it holds. and uh, just to see how it works in general. So GoPro's all set up. Let's go.